this video looks at the key formulae which we have when we talk about sectors. Now we know that if you have a sector with an angle x and a radius r, that the arc length is r times x and the area of the sector is a half r squared times x. So again, r is a radius and x is the angle. So in this question we know the angle and the area. And the question is, is what's the radius? Well, we can use the area formula to deduce what r actually equals. So we know that the area is 45. So 45 equals a half times r squared times by x, which is 1.6. So I must solve this for r. So if I begin by times in by 2, I get 90 equals r squared times 1.6. So I've times up by 2. I can then divide by 1.6. So r squared equals 90 over 1.6, which works out at 56.25. So to find r, I just do the square root of 56.25, which works out at 7.5 centimetres. So I've managed to rearrange the formula to find what r equals. I can therefore find the perimeter of the sector. Now I can find the arc length, which is the curved part of the sector, by doing r times x. So the arc length will just be the radius, which we found to be 7.5, times by the angle, which is 1.6, which works out to be 12 centimetres. That's the arc length of the sector. The perimeter is the arc plus the two radii. So the perimeter just equal 12 plus one radius plus another radius which equals 27 centimeters.